So today I'm going to be teaching you how you can create your own Gmail signature very quickly and easily. Now a Gmail signature is the end of every email. It makes it seem professional. You can include your name, title, link and a picture of you. And this kind of really helps everything you send seem legitimate and it's very easy to do. So the first thing you want to do is head over to your inbox, go into your emails and then in the top right hand corner next to your image, click on the settings icon. Now after this, click see all settings. And it will take you to this page, I can now zoom out. And on this page you'll see loads of settings. We're going to stick in the general tab and we're going to scroll down until we see the signature section. Now this is the signature section, click create new, we'll call it signature one. Um, and then right here it brings up this text box where we can put anything we want to inside of this box. Now to make it look cool and stand out, now we are going to head over to a Google Doc. So once you're on Google, click up this, this menu icon in the top right hand corner and scroll down until you see documents. Blank and then once we're on the blank document, press insert table one by one and we can see right here we've got, sorry two by one. Head over to this right hand box and type in anything we want inside of this box. You might want your name, um, what you do, your position, your website. So I've already filled all of this information out in a separate document. So yeah, I've got my name, my position, what platforms and my website. So then what we want to do is customize this. So highlight all of the bits you want to make bigger. Then right here, I'm going to have this in italics, something like this. Um, you can obviously, if you want to add a few more little things inside the text box. Also a quick little side note, depending on how much space you want between the eventual image on the left and the words on the right, you want to drag and drop this in accordance. So I think the best thing to do, although I didn't do it in this tutorial, is to have it about here. But if you want lots of space between the left hand side and the right hand side, i.e. the text and image, then you can move it more to the middle, but I like it here. So once we've got everything inside of the table that we want, yep, right click inside the table, and then we're going to go on table properties, and it's gonna say, you know, all these options, click on color, click on border, and make the border zero. Then once we've done this, we're gonna highlight the whole thing, copy it, um, right here, head back over to our Gmail signature box, and we're then going to paste it. Perfect. Now we've got a hidden table basically, and in this left hand side what we can do is upload a picture. So go insert an image, and then once that's uploaded, click the size small, once you click on the image, and then we can see that our signature is pretty much ready to rumble. So once we've done this, when it says signature defaults, we are going to use on, for new email use, press signature one, on reply slash forward use, signature one save changes and now on any new email we will see that signature so thank you very much for watching i hope that helped take care and i'll see you again soon